Good morning, Josh here with Dicom Solutions. Just wanted to uh, give you guys a quick demonstration of our podiatry system. This one's made by 2020, and um, there's two different styles that this podiatry system comes in. You can buy the complete system, which is everything you see here, plus computers on the digital side, and uh, or you could also do a retrofit, which is using an existing uh, generator, which is this box here, and an existing tube, and putting it onto a new platform with the DR acquisition laptop and a PAC system. Um, that's what's shown here is the retrofit. This platform meets ADA requirements, so it's a lot lower than the old ones, and it um, meets the ADA um, specifications. This is where the DR can be inserted if you wanted to take PA or AP shots. So you insert it here. It gets connected to a computer via USB, and there's a power cord. Patient would put their foot up on here, and then the technician could take the uh, exposure, exposure switch, uh, set the right techniques, and then take the shot. The shot would then come up onto the acquisition laptop screen um, where it could be modified before saving it to pack. Also, what is uh, great about this system is that the tube head moves side to side, so you could take, drop the tube head down at whatever angle you need to take whatever shot is required. Take the DR, pop it over here, then you have every shot that is needed for a lateral or any other uh, angle that's needed, which obviously can hold anybody's weight. Um, then, so once the uh, image is acquired from the acquisition laptop, it's uh, put any annotations on it, window level, saved, set to PAX. This is a, a similar uh, setup to the PAX system that comes with the system. Uh, a tower computer, and it actually comes with a 20-inch monitor, but this is uh, being displayed for our purposes on this uh, LED TV. This is this is the actual software here, so you have the tools and things across the top, um, multiple different shots that were taken here. You can drag, drag and drop as needed. Um, so this is a quick demonstration of what the PAX software would look like.